Hello everyone! Welcome to another episode of Two Sip Violin. Now, you might be wondering, where are they? Hmm. It's not a white wall anymore. We finally upgraded! <laughs> Ooh, eight years! Level up! I can't believe it took us eight years. Yeah. Uh, you imagine most like other content creators, they're just doing like the first year. Yeah, yeah. but you know, everyone goes on the journey at their own pace. Yes. But anyway, we're very excited. We're back from our little week break. And as you can see, we've got a new studio set up, filming set up. I wanted to just show you guys it today. So. Over here, you can see Ooh. the Ling Ling clock. Why is it the Ling Ling clock? Because there's 40 hours in the day. Look at that. You know what I just realized? Oh. It probably should be 20 and then goes twice. Oh yeah. But hey, it's, it's a one-way clock. It's different. To make it less complicated for everyone to understand <laughs> the theories of Ling Ling. That's why it's a one-way clock. Yeah, with this clock, you can practice 40 hours a day. Or maybe 80 hours if you're really that prodigy. Yes. For those of you that have been to our virtual tour, you'll know the significance of this clock. It's also a time-traveling machine. Mm -hmm. but, um, yeah, anyway. Here we have... A plant to for aesthetics. Aesthetics to provide some oxygen, even though it's fake. It feels like there's more oxygen to keep us going for the videos. We have a metronome. It's you one of those old school ones, you know? Yeah. You, you wind, this you one wind one. it up. Right here. Oh, it's already one. It's it's right up. You pick your tempo and you let it run. So that's the metronome. And I like the old school ones actually. Used to practice those. Yeah. Above the metronome is uh we won't say too much, but it's for a project coming soon. I think it's nice to have the leaf there blocking. Classified information. Yeah, so we're gonna keep it like that. When will it come out? Like in a month's time? Probably. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe, maybe I don't not. Know. Maybe I don't, not. I don't know. Don't know. Don't know. We have a time clock. So the story behind this alarm clock is um I struggle traditionally waking up. I'm the type that I will like my phone will go off. And I'll just, in my sleep, get out of bed, walk over, press snooze, like, turn it off, and go back to sleep. And you won't remember it. So, I bought this clock, thinking that I could put it, like, outside in the living room, and it'll wake me up. But no, because I just turn off and fall back asleep. <laughs> now it's just a decorative you can You can literally put the clock, like, down the road, Eddie will still walk down the road and come back and go to sleep. <laughs> Probably. Yeah. And of course, we have the book, The Study of Orchestration. Mm -hmm. Very important. Jordan recommended it. It's yes. a really good book, because, as you know, Jordan's... Very good composer. <laughs> this is not oh, I've got to turn on. TikTok. This is a quaver. It's like the sharp sign. It's not yeah. a hashtag. It's, it's a not a hashtag. Sign. It's a sharp sign. Freaking young people. Alright, coming anyway. up next, we have the Automatone and a bubble tea plushie. Mm -hmm. Boba chan. Boba chan. Always drink bubble tea in moderation. Now we have here Rengoku. Rengoku, one of my favorite characters in mm. the anime Demon Slayer, just because he's such a mad guy. Mm. He's, he's awesome. He's awesome. Oh my! So yeah, that's why he's here, just giving us support. This... How would you explain this? Uh, for those of that went to our virtual tour, you'll know this red button, along with the bubble tea, mm -hmm. is what activates the time-traveling 40-hour clock. So really, you think you spent 5 minutes watching this video already, but you've already spent... 20 hours. Yeah, exactly. Time distortion. Moving on. 40! Very obvious. Mm -hmm. For those who don't know, get with it. Next one is... It's what I got for Brett for Christmas. It's uh, the Spotify plaque of his lo-fi. Mm. You can actually scan it or start playing his lo-fi. Yeah. We'll give you a close-up to scan yeah. it later. <laughs> and of course we have the bell. It's the bell you don't want to hear when you're in the audition. Da -da, da -da, da -da. Oh! <laughs> Thank you, that is enough. Thank we you. will contact you. <laughs> Last but not least, we must have beautiful music scores. Hayden's hiding. Yeah, Hayden's in the corner. So we have a lot of great scores here. The thing, the thing that's really special about these scores, they're not just normal scores. These are actually really expensive. So they're Henle and they're Urtext. Now yes. Urtext means they've gone out of their way to research to get as close to the original mm -hmm. as the composer's markings because as music goes down, you know, a lot of performers or editors add their own little things to, you know, make playing the music easier. Like, I've, got a, I've got an example. They make it easier, they give fingering suggestions, they give bowing suggestions, dynamic and expression markings. But throughout that, you get further and further away from what the composer initially wanted. And so the real pro musicians, they go back to the urtext yes. and they interpret from the source. Ooh. Actually, I noticed here that they sometimes give you 
two samples. Mm-hmm. Well, the Bach double, they have two. Yeah. One with the fingerings and bowings in it. So like the Mendelssohn, they have a little bit that says who's it by. Finger and bowing by this guy here. Yeah. And then there's also, this is just another edition. You can see it. That's like the edition we play as kids, like yeah. the Asian edition. The Asian edition. Yeah. <laughs> All the Asian yeah. kids yeah. are like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and uh, this is heavy. Yeah. And bowings and fingerings and and then you'll notice a lot of things are different, you know? So look at this. They slur this in, right? But here, it's a different bowing. Oh! So there's just, there's just two different interpretations. I don't know if you guys can see the... Nah, it's too much. Uh, anyway. yeah, this is a room tour, not a... Yeah, the music. Uh, lecture it. in... And uh, this is beautiful because they have new scores. So, yeah. that's our room tour. The mic's above here now. It's not here, so... In a way. Because it was always a bit awkward, the yeah. stand. Yes. And a little light. Oh yeah. Corner. Bet you think you can't do this. Oh, this. Oh, this. Oh, I didn't change it. <laughs> Why is it not working? Oh wait. Oh. Wait, watch this. Fade. Whoa! Oh, I didn't know I could do that. No, but we're gonna stick to. Dude, that's insane. Yeah, we're gonna stick to this color. Whoa, I'm like... <laughs> you wouldn't even realize. I feel like I got hypnotized. I'm yeah. like, whoa. I, I really like the, um... This color. This color, yeah. And then purple's also nice. Anyway. Okay, anyway. Uh, this is meant to be like a two-minute video, but it's gone on very long. Thanks to everyone that's been with us for all this time. Yes. We hope to be making even more epic content in the future. Yeah, so for those of you are new, go watch our content. Accent the like button and the gato the subscribe button. And we'll see you guys next time. Good practice!